Hey guys, Slickwing here. Um, enjoy this nice, uh, this nice crackling fire. Um, I'm doing an intro this way because I wanted to kind of let you know that this video starts off a little weird. Uh, part one and part two, I had actually initially recorded as one episode, um, but it ended up being like 45 minutes long. So bear with me. That's gonna start off a little weird, but great episode. Really proud of how this one ended. Um, thanks for watching and enjoy. You know what? I I couldn't end the episode that way. I, I got really rocking and rolling on this thing uh, even after the episode, so um, I couldn't stay away. Let me show you guys. Okay, I'm gonna turn this way. Something behind me that I'll show you in a minute. But, ba bam! Look at that. That's so pretty, colorful. Um, I had quite a bit of help. Um, Newbie was helping me, and uh, uh, Tara was helping me here. Still kind of stuck though, because uh, check it out. I want to have all 16 colors. I'm having issues with some of them growing. We, for a bit, thought it was because I was using fertilized dirt, but that's not the case. All of these trees grew on fertilized dirt. Um, the only catch is you can't bone meal them when they're on there. The thing is, though, um, light gray seems to be having an issue. The weird thing, I move them around to different places, and then they will grow. Um, didn't really have any issues with pink. Uh, gray would not grow over there, anywhere. None of these on this half, would it wouldn't grow anywhere. And for some reason, this one and this one will not grow. Um... So if you guys have any tips, anybody out there in YouTube land as to what's going on, how I fix it, what I'm missing, um, we were all here uh, working and moving stuff, and um, I think I was the only one just because I, I, it drives me nuts that this isn't working. Uh, so, but not not to belittle the help that I got, uh, newbie Tara, you guys have been awesome on this. Um, now let me show you this. Bop. Bam. Big? Yes. Complicated? Yes. Too much? No. Never too much. Um, could I have made this thing in a lot fewer blocks and a lot simpler? Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm okay with sacrificing simplicity and stuff for the sake of looking cool, and I think this looks cool. Um, so, quick rundown of what we got. We've got our harvesters here. Harvesters will harvest the trees and the saplings, so you get wood and all that fun stuff goes into this chest. Um, I have not fixed this because I don't know what colors I'm going to have growing on each side. So for right now, I, I don't have it turned on. It's not operational, but once I have that figured out, then I'll go ahead and whitelist the saplings on, on each side. So saplings come down here, na -na 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 -na, over to planter. Then what we're going to have, which I haven't done yet, I'm going to have this item duct is going to continue out. Uh, I think I'll just put it here at the end. Um, I'm going to have like two lockers, uh, the reinforced. What is he doing? Why? Why? I will show you guys that really cool thing that he's doing later. Um, it's, oh, it's Lorian. Hi. How are you? Never see you around. Um, yeah, we got a full house today. It's pretty cool. Um, Lorian's on, which never happens. Tangy's here. She's phenomenal. I'll show you guys next episode her little her building. Um, I am super impressed with her building skills. Uh, so anyway, I used leadstone injury conduit. Why? Uh, I just had a whole buttload laying around. So I was like, well, I can either trash it or use it, and I'll use it. It's plenty for what we're doing here. Um, now, on the wood side of it, I think you guys understand that part. Wood side. Whoops. Click that. Um, we have our four different types of wood here, whitelisted. They will come here. This is really just to help prevent backup. Um, like I think I have a buttload of wood floating around in here right now because I've just been throwing stuff in. Um, what they will then do, these two, both sides are set up the same. They feed these two redstone furnaces. Why two redstone furnaces? Symmetry. It looks pretty. Um, then what we have, once these cook into charcoal, charcoal will then travel up here 
into the steam dynamo. The steam dynamo is being fed from two aqueous accumulators. I don't have a source block there yet. I'm kind of waiting to see if these things fill up. I don't know if they will or not. It, it's been a little bit. Dynamo's full, but they're not filling. So I don't know. Maybe the ducts have to completely fill. Either way, it doesn't really matter. I will be putting one there just because I... Why not? Um, so what we have here, item ducts travel up to the steam dynamo. They also branch off here and go back that way. Um, yeah, maybe. Yeah, I will. I will show you. Let's go into bat mode so we fit. Um, now what should happen here, I haven't actually turned this thing on to make sure, but what should happen here, steam dynamo is going to take the precedence. Um, it should try to push charcoal there first. If the steam dynamo is full, then the overflow should travel along here, which goes up and no, I'm not going to fit. So I will just take you guys up. Basically, it goes up and over around here, all inside. I'm not going to show you. Boom. Look at that bit of gorgeousness. Who's running around in here? Look at this. So we have more steam dynamos. And this is actually going to go all the way up. Um, I've not hooked up the aqueous accumulators to feed these things yet. I will do that. Um, redstone energy conduit. So all of these guys' juice powers into there. I, I Honestly, I don't even know if the redstone energy conduit is going to be able to handle the amount of power these guys put. But like I said, I will sacrifice that for the sake of looking cool. How many of us have worn something cool on like a hot day, you know? And, and like, I don't know, gone through like a leather jacket phase <clears throat> myself. Uh, yeah, we do that. But I was kind of messing around and I, I just got inspired. Check these out. So I had these leftover magenta lamps. And I don't know if this is going to look really all that cool, but I'm going to try it. So what I want to do, I imagine this bank of lights. Ooh, you know what? Maybe, maybe I don't put them back there because you, you can't really see that. Yeah, you don't really see that. Let's do this. Let's move them forward. I had actually planned on just popping in here and banging out what I was going to bang out for you guys. But let's change it up. Let's change it up. Show you guys how, how the mind of Wang works. Um, let's put you guys right here. Okay, you go there, and I'm going to need a little room behind you, so let's do that. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, so we have this bank of lights. Now, what says futuristic and, and energy and all that kind of stuff? Lights moving in a direction. Am I right? I'm right. Don't worry. You don't have to say. So, what we are going to do is... I want to make a lot of this stuff later. Later, uh, What I've done, I've gone ahead, smelted up some red alloy ingots. Um, if you don't, how do I do that? Mm, right click? No. Shift right click? No. Uh, I'll show you how to make that real quick. Red alloy ingots. Uh, basically what you do, piece of iron, surround it with redstone, smelt it, Boom, smelt it there. You get these. We are going to make some red alloy wire. Uh, boom. Let's just make a bunch. Oh, yeah, it's sensitive. You have to actually do it in the middle. Okay, we have that, and we have some wool. We are going to make some insulated wire. Um, actually, let's go ahead and put this here. Place. Place, place, place. Okay, uh, now, I don't want that to go that way. Quick explanation of what I'm going to do. I have this all carved out over here, and you'll see why in a moment. Um, we are going to use uh, insulated red alloy wire. So I'll show you that real quick. Insulated red alloy wire. Oh, really? Oh, pecker. Pecker, pecker. I'm going to need to make some more of those. I, You know what? I went off of memory, and I could have swore it was red alloy wire, 
And then the wool? No, it's the ingots. Pecker. Okay. Um, I can fix that. Anyway, insulated red alloy wire. So we will have four separate circuits. And those will travel along here with bundled bundled cable. And what you do is you can feed up to 16 different circuits, different colored circuits into these. And you can actually go even further than that because then you could bundle the bundled wire and give those different colors. It's insane. Uh, so we make that. We will feed our four separate circuits into that. It will travel along here over to here where I am going to put a sequencer. So let's go ahead and let's craft up the sequencer. Uh, let's head over to my my Hoosie Watts, my crafting station. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Ba -dum -ba -ba. Okay, so we do those. We're going to need some redstone torches, which means we need some wood. In fact, let's just, you know what? Boop. I'll just take a half stack. Thank you. Thank you for holding that for me, redstone furnace. You look pretty. You look super pretty. You don't do a damn thing yet, but you look super pretty. Um... Yeah, let's just go ahead and make them all. Because we are going to need a few. Um, how, should we, how many should we make? Let's do let's do 20. Why not? Why not? Why not? I don't know. That's why we're doing it. If I don't have a good reason not to, then I'm going to do it. Uh, let's go here. And we are going to need a pointer, which requires some stone. And I don't have the stone. See? Thought I was ready. Thought I was ready. Bonk. I is ready. How you like that? Just didn't have it in my inventory. Ye of little faith. Okay. Uh, pointer is just that one. Shift click. I only need one. Thank you very much. Um, I do need one, two, three. I need four of those. Uh, click you. Shift right click. Oh, pff, stupid. One, two, three, four. And then what's the other one? Okay, just the plates. We are ready. Sequencer. Uh, you know what? Let's make a knot gate too, because I just remembered my lights are inverted. Um, what are you? Oh, that's right. Okay, okay. So we go doop, doop, doop. Come on. Come on, redstone. Come with me now. And I need a couple more of you. How many do I need? I need one, two, three of you guys and one of you. And um, you guys tell me if you prefer to see me craft the stuff. I don't know. I'm not entirely sold on it. You guys, you guys tell me. Vote. Take a vote. Raise hands. No, don't raise hands. Nobody's going to see you. This is the internet. Make a U, make a U. Okay. Now, sequencer. Why am I putting it all the way over here, you ask? Because it's noisy. Hear it? So I want to get out over here. I didn't even test this. That's a pretty good guess. Can't hear it now. Awesome. So we are going to take... A red alloy wire. I need a circuit coming off of you, and you, and you. Then, thinking, thinking. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go make some more of those red alloy ingots because I, like a dummy, was like, oh yeah, just use the wire. Nope, gotta use the ingot. So let me go craft some of those. I'll be right back. Talk dirty to me. Talk dirty to me. That's a good song. Okay. Crafted up. Ready to rock. Um, first things first. We need four different colors of wool. Uh, we could use white, but psh, come on. Come on, baby. Uh, let's break out a little pink. Yeah, a little light blue. And magenta. 
yes, Wang could probably have just put a whole buttload of cotton right here and changed the dyes, but that's not how we roll. Um, okay, bump, 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 bump. And, oh, I hope we have enough. I'm running a little low on redstone right now. I really need to get a good farm going. Uh, let's put, let's just get rid of you. I don't need you right now. You're going to pop right back in. I knew that. And magenta. Boink. And let's see. Boink. Ba ba ba. Boink. And what was our last one? What am I missing? Oh, the light blue. Da do. Da do. Boop. Go away. Go away. Go away. Okay. We have four separate insulated wires. Now, the nice thing is. Is this going to work? Yeah, okay, so we have a light blue there. We will make an orange here. And let's bring... What we want to do is we want to bring all these down. See how they don't connect? Check that out. Super cool. I'll tell you guys, if you're not using this Red Alloy Wire Project Red stuff, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with you. I need to fix that. Let's do this, actually, since I have to fix that anyway. Something really cool. Um, I think this may have been... I, I like to imagine that the mob creators worked together when they did this. Um, I don't know. But, micro blocks. Let's just... Uh, you know what? I got, I got extra wool. Let's do that. Um, you can use panels. Uh, we are going to use the teeny tiny little strips. The only reason I'm cutting them all is I have no more inventory. Started out okay, but... Bonk. And bonk. Check that out. Um, where's our other color? Magenta. You guys like my singing voice? It's pretty great. Pretty great. Had a lot of training. Not really. Okay. Bring you down. Um, nope, nope. Wang has this wrong. Wang has it wrong. Um, thinking, 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 thinking. Can I? It's bringing this fourth one down. That's giving me trouble. That's what's that's what's causing trouble for me. Um. I don't know. I'll work it out. We gonna work it out. Um, let's move on. Let's move on to something different. Get rid of you. Get my knock gate back. And yeah, we'll do that. So just in the time that I was crafting that stuff, I kind of changed my mind. I changed placement. So I thought, you know what? This is going to be more visible, easier to get to. Plus, I had them right here on this side, and then I realized, hmm, that's going to look weird. So I put them back here. Uh, what we want. We need to break out some of this. Okay, so we are going to have, we want to put these in order. So we have pink. Let's do this in order. Put them right here in, hey. Okay, pink. And then orange. Okay, pink, orange, then blue. Because we still got to micro block that. Let's micro block that right now. There we go. Much better. Um, pink, orange, blue. There's our blue. There's our blue. And last, but certainly not least, magenta. Okay, the reason we want to put those in order, it would look really weird. Okay, so this thing is sequencing. It's going around and around. It's following the same pattern. Um, if we didn't follow that, this would just be like random blinking lights, which would look cool too, but it's not what I'm going for. Okay, now, 
we need some plain Jane wire. No cobble. Go away, cobble. Plain Jane wire there, 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 there. Okay, now, so we have our separate circuits. Pink, orange, blue, and magenta. Now, let's see if I can figure out how to do this the right way. Uh, what we want is the bundled cable. And I'm almost curious. We might try it. I don't know. I'm thinking about running the bundled cable just into the NOT gate. I don't know if it'll invert everything or not. So, bundled cable. You just use whatever different insulated wires. Um, it could be all the same color, could be different colors, doesn't matter. Um, let's actually go ahead. We're going to need, um, you know what? I better not do that. Better save some of those. Put you there, and you there. There you go. Good little mix. Uh, now let's get some string. The only bad thing about having several people on the server at once. It's great having everybody on, but you get a little lag. Get a little lag. We don't need the wool anymore. Uh, I can't do anything with you guys. Let's clear. Let's clear some of this mess out. There we go. Um, actually. I don't need you guys either. Okay. One, two, three, go. Let's just get some string. Uh, I think I can spare it. 66,000 pieces of string. I killed a lot of spiders, dog. Killed a lot of spiders. No, not really. I'll show you guys how to make that stuff in a later episode. It's pretty handy little... Oh, man, this is expensive. Well, it is what it is. Let's do one more. Um, hey. Okay, well, we'll just do that. Okay. Um, I'm not going to make you guys watch me go do this. I should have researched that a little better. Now, if I put you there, and then if I do there, Ho -ho. Okay, so here's the plan. That's awesome. I am going to, and I might actually, that might make this a whole lot easier. A whole lot easier. I would just run bundled cable all the way up to that. Yeah, we're going to do that. And it should work. And then I'm going to try the knot gate too. So, I'm going to cut, gather all those resources, put it down, and show you guys what we got okay one expensive mess later um, I haven't installed the knot gates yet I did a test um, just putting a knot gate on the bundled wire doesn't work probably because it doesn't know what circuit it's not going to assume all of them um, unless there's a magic way of doing that I don't know but check it out she be working boop, boop, boop. so we're gonna go invert these right now um, now, check this out. This thing spinning that way. So right now, the light is going to be moving up. Well, right now the off one is moving up, but when we switch this around, it's going to be going, it'll be blinking in an upward direction. We want it to go the other way. Shift, right click, goes the other way. I want it to go up though. We'll pretend that I did it on purpose. Uh, okay, now, not gates. I went ahead and crafted four off screen for you guys. Now, this is going to get a little messy. Okay, so our in, boom. Now, let's shift right click. And you see it'll pretty much go through just about every cycle. Okay, so that's what we want. We want our output right there. Okay, uh, now, here's why that's kind of important. When we put one here, see how it connects there? That's just a whole mess. Okay, so we are going to clicky click. And you see every time that I de deactivate this, you can tell because there's no redstone on it, it disconnects. Awesome. I love Project Red. Um, boom. Okay, so our in, yes. Shift, right click. Disconnect those. Boom. Last, 
but certainly not least, we need to give you a rotate job and a shifty right click. Doop. Okay. Looks correct. Let's go see. I'm so excited. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, that is so beautiful. Tell me that's not cool, guys. Tell me that's not cool. Oh, love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Oh, I'm really proud of this one. Really proud. Really, really proud. So it's like there's that pillar. Uh, I'm going to have some micro blocked things to fill this in. It'll look, it'll look nice. Um, wow. Okay. I feel super accomplished right now. We got that pretty much handled. Definitely need some tips on why those ones ain't working, but I am I am happy, super happy. Uh, and then this gorgeous little thing, wow, wow, I love it. Um, it's an expensive mess, so I'm not going to do the same thing on this side. I think on this side I'll have like my on-off switch, which I, I have a couple ideas for. I might play around with that, um, but short episode that I didn't want to be that short turned into a longer episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, really, really appreciate the support. Appreciate you guys watching. Uh, it really feels great. Uh, I am going to wrap this thing up and I will see you guys in the next episode.